Welcome to Jurassic Park. <laughs> okay guys, so what we have here is a veritable forest of nettles that has grown here you know, over the last sort of one and a half years where this used to be a compost heap. We had building work put in in the fences along here and obviously we weren't able to access up here for a while and this grew. Now I want to turn this into a little patch for blackberries, blueberries, raspberries um, and I wanted to put a grapevine along the back of that fence also. Um, but first all this has to go. <laughs> this is gonna be a right old treat. Now as you can see it's very overgrown all around here. Uh, fence border there um, so what I'm gonna have to do is I've bought a bill hook which I'll show you in a minute and I'm gonna cut my way through here hopefully quite effectively now unfortunately I can't show you one bill hooks a little dangerous to you so I need to concentrate when I'm using it but secondly um, you can see there's nowhere to put a tripod up here to show you um, or somewhere to put my, prop my phone against to show you uh, using it but hopefully I'll show you the after effects uh, yeah it's gonna be fun all right guys, so this is my bill hook, okay? It's a two-handed tool, okay? That basically you swing around a little bit like an ax. <laughs> Except you can see it's got a slight curved blade, uh, sharp all the way down this side, okay? And it's sharp just in that little bit there for when you need to hack something that's on the ground. Um, uh, about five minutes in, and as you can see, I've cut through quite a bit there already. So I've managed to get a little bit of perch at the top by this fence. Um, so making good progress, Bill Hook is doing a fantastic job. I may have won the battle, but I still need to win the war. <laughs> Shattered. And the first bit of collateral damage as well. <laughs> that was a, a wild swing from the Bill Hook that went through these nettles and kind of carried on into there. Uh, you know, one of those. Pose, really a word of warning. Uh, definitely don't have anyone nearby you whilst you're using a tool like this because, well, if you miss, you're going to do some damage. I mean, I've locked my dogs away uh, inside the house because, you know, they can creep up behind you and uh, we don't want any injuries like that. So always take safety first, guys. Um, but uh, I'm enjoying this. Um, it's good old fashioned hard work. Yeah. Well, I think it's, uh, whilst I take a five minute break, time for Facts with Big Al. <laughs> well, anyway, yesterday I managed to read whilst I was looking at nettles and how to, you know, I was just trying to learn it, right? You know, when you're trying to do something, you kind of Google things and just try to learn new facts. At least I do anyway. And um, I actually read that nettles are actually not truly native, so to speak, to the UK. Now, they have been for a long, long time, don't get me wrong. But they were actually introduced to the UK by the Romans, who, when they invaded the UK, um, or the Isle of Albion, I believe it was back then, um, couldn't really, you know, tolerate our cold climate. Um, and so they brought over with them the nettle plant. Um, and the whole purpose of that is Apparently, when you rub yourself with nettles in the cold, it actually helps keep you warm. It certainly helps you make it helps you feel warmer at the very least. Um, it also has similar qualities for helping deal with pain. So, if you've got a particular muscle ache, I don't know, maybe like arthritis, or uh, maybe you've got a, you know a wound of some kind, providing you keep the room clean, um, you can wipe nettles on it, and it will actually help reduce the pain. Interesting facts. Just thought I'd share that with you. Now, back to work. All right, let's play spot the dock leaf. I've just got clipped on my forearm, my left forearm. Oh man, I don't know what type of stinging nettle that was, but oh God, it hurts. <laughs> I'm a proper stinging. A dock leaf, a dock leaf, a dock leaf. I don't know, what was it? A dock leaf, a dock leaf. I, my king, take three. A dock leaf, a dock leaf. My kingdom for a dock leaf.